discovered something. It took me a long time to figure it out. I mean, you can call me slow if you want to, but... Anyways, I discovered something. And I now it's all come to me now I understand what's really going on in the world these days, or these days. I understand there's a heaven and hell. I understand that what reason why we're on earth and what's our purpose and so I understand you have to live and learn for one and the other is how are you want to take it because if you think about it when you do pass away your spirit or your some people call it ghost go into another dimension and basically you everything that you learn on earth you take it with you but some don't believe that you don't uh you got control and pleasure and you i guess you can't take pleasure with you but what i understand so far now is you're learning how to be a god because that's what the bible's about it talks about gods and we learn from that and we take that knowledge and then we go and rule heaven or a part of heaven because heaven I guess is huge as fuck but you have a choice you got heaven and hell well everybody thinks when you die there's a hell somewhere in heaven you know no hell is on earth we're already in hell we already know what this side looks like and you keep telling yourself, well, should I, uh, you know. <laughs> you know, and what I understand now is it's they, or say the New World Order, and the Deep State, and the Illuminati, and the Freemasons, it's all about control and pleasure, and you can't take that with you, but they want to take your health care away, because that's one thing. Depopulation second thing is is you got 20 2025 and they got to do all all the you know I'm trying to understand this one thing we don't need to and I don't support Russia anyways Russian women are not bad looking uh, the young ones uh, so but the whole thing is, is take care of the medical system, take control of the money system. And because the reason why you want to control all the banks is because we don't know how to spend our money right. And y'all want to control that. The money system and our health care. Them are the two things that y'all guys want to do. The other thing is, is, you know how Hitler, you know, went, once he got what he wanted, that's what that man was trying to do, is to take over the world. You know, and you always watch that pinky in the brain. Kind of reminds me of what Joe Biden is. Uh, anyway, so the point is, is people started noticing that I talk to around here but I don't tell them what the deep state's plan is because I don't give a fuck I really don't give a fuck about people I really don't I worry what I have to do in life to move forward and then I can live and learn from that and then take it to me one day it's my time I go to heaven and man I learned I lived and learned but the whole thing is about control the money system and us have everything on our cell phones like China and have cameras everywhere so you can play God and know where we go and a fingerprint is not your identity anymore your faces and a universal like it's all everything universal background check on guns you know things like that but that's what I discovered the reason why we're on Earth is because 
we're we're people to learn, live and learn and how society is supposed to work. And so where we can, you know, become gods eventually, but you have to work your ass off for it. Anybody can become a god. Anybody can rule the world, right? Tears of fears. <laughs> But people to, you know, understand this a little bit further. But here's the thing. Why would I join a secret society? I mean, I already know about the secret society. I know who the old people are. It's all Nazis that came over here when the German War happened. I'm going to name the guys off. George Soros. Henry Kissinger. Uh, the other guy I call Ash Schwabs. Them are the guys that we all look at, and Bill Gates, and that's what we look at. And a lot of people say, oh, the, the money is the root of all evil. Well, not necessarily. Money runs the world, war runs the world, they control it all. Should we accept this new world order? Should we bow to these people and serve them as our gods? You wonder. Friendly control point nearby. But the reason I'm saying this is because I'm a person I want to keep to myself. I don't bother with anybody. And I'm not going to sit there. I mean, I love to hold cash. But the dollar is going down the drain hole very soon. I wouldn't say soon, but I say here in the next couple of years, the dollar will have no value anymore. And the only thing we have to depend on is gold and silver. But if the gold is doing good, uh, that means the deep state is not. That means you're losing your power. And then people start noticing and then you got to take over their narrative. No, 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 that's not what's what happened. And look behind the curtain. There's nothing to see here like the Wizard of Oz. You have to do misdirection. Then one after you do that, and you got everybody's focus off of one thing and worrying about the other, so y'all can go behind the scenes and do what you got to do. And then you got to do scaring tactics on people. Like example, World War Three, with Russia. And if you don't have control, you got to take the guns and the ammo away. And you're going to constantly do this. There will eventually be a civil war because I had images of the Statue of Liberty fucking in half. And the White House was burning. I have images of a lot of fucking crazy shit. I did some things in the past. I fucked with a Ouija board when I was young. But no, I see numbers all the fucking time now. And I see that, including my uncle, what he was. And then, now that I understand, you're learning how to be a god, and then you take it with you to heaven, where you can rule a part of heaven. I think you do. Uh, you, you do. You do get... And I get cold chills every time that... What's going on, I see on the media... Fake news. Because Donald J. Trump... They are going after him... After a, what, a seven year... Thing. And I, I could have said to you guys right off the bat... That couldn't hold up in court because... That was hush hush money. Y'all are doing panic moves. It shows that you're panicking. And I thought y'all had a lot of patience, but you don't. Because y'all's time is running out. You have a time and date to take over the United States. And put everybody under your control. And have them do what you want them to do. And then when you get tired of us, you're going to kill us off. You get bored.